got a gap with a gas mask on it. Think about the fact you can pass that chronic. Talk about a fact that a rap get punched. I'm the miggity, 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 mag that gone it. That's that black cat. Ooh, what's up, my cover? I see a bar to cover back at it with another new series. Today, we're going to be starting up the Telltale Walking Dead series. We're starting off with season one. We're going to go all the way up to the final season. Boom, shakalaka. Let's go ahead and get into it. Uh, boom, we're going to do standard because yeah, we're doing a new day. Boom, shakalaka. This about to be fun, y'all. This is one of my favorite games, Loki. Walking Dead is like one of my all-time favorite things ever. Like, I love the Walking Dead show. Like, these games were great. It's crazy to think that like these games kind of take place before the the show in a way, but it's also kind of in its own like world at the same time, I guess. I don't know if that makes sense or not. The Walking Dead. Do do. Do, 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 do. Oh, episode one, a new day. Poor Lee. How you doing, Lee? All in prison and shit. Hope y'all in, uh, uh, enjoy this series, because I'm finna enjoy it. It's about to be fun. I know I got a lot of series going on. It's, it's kind of crazy. <laughs> I'm just kind of, I'm trying to test out new games and, like, play new stuff. Well, I reckon you didn't do it, then. I did it. You know what they say about reckoning? Why do you say that? You know, I've driven a bunch of fellas down to this prison. Lord knows mm -hmm. how many. Usually it's about now I get the, I didn't do it. Not for me. Cause guys in your position already said it enough. <laughs> I followed your case a little bit. You being a mm -hmm. Macon boy and all. You're from Macon then. Yep. Came up to Atlanta to be a city cop in the seventies. Okay. Always wanted to work a murder case. Like that senatorial mess you got yourself mixed up in. With uh, all due respect. A real shame, that is. Hell, the whole family used to be regulars at your folks' drugstore right in downtown. Still there? Sure is. Good. Uh, at least that's good. I guess. Oh, he got a shotgun. important to you? All of it. But that box never shuts up. Sit in this seat and pay too much attention, and you'll drive yourself crazy. Do, do, I got a nephew up do, at UGA. Do, 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 do. You uh -huh. fish there long? Going on a six year. You meet your wife in Athens? I did. I think. I don't know. Probably. You want to know how I see it? How you see it? Sure. Regardless, tell me. <laughs> it could be you just married the wrong woman. I mean, yeah. <sighs> You'll have to learn to stop worrying about things you can't control. Okay. Yeah, look at all them SWAT vehicles and shit. That's crazy. <laughs> there was a lot of them. Alright. I'm driving this man once. He he was the worst one. He wouldn't stop going on about how he didn't do it. No. He was an older fella, big soft eyes behind a pair of smart folk glasses. And he just okay. wailing back there. Says it wasn't him. Crying and snotting all over right where you're sitting. Actually. Then before long, he starts kicking the back of the seat like, like a fussy baby on an airplane. Not tell him he's got to stop. But that's government property. And I'll be forced to zap him otherwise. So he stops, and having exhausted all his options, he starts crying out for his mama. Mama, it's all a big mistake. It wasn't me. So did he do it? <coughs> they caught the fucker red-handed, stabbing his wife, cutting her up as the boys came through the door. Damn. 
He sits in my car screaming bloody murder that it wasn't him. I think he actually believed it himself. It goes to show. I mean, I guess, yeah, I guess sometimes you lie to yourself enough so you, you start to believe your own lie. I got another good one for you. This one's a little bit less depressing and a bit more hilarious if I do say so. Oh, shit! This other time... Oh, shit! <laughs> oh, we dead as hell. Oh, we dead as fuck. Oh, shit. Ow. Well, you dead as fuck. Right there. Good lord. That's our crash and a half right there. That was a crash and a half right there. Oh no, they gonna kill my they gonna kill my police officer, man. Ah shit, here we go again. Get up, Lee. We got places to be. Zombies oh, to kill. Shit. Thirsty. Ah, <laughs> Thirsty. Fuck. Understandable. Hey. Yeah, that probably would hurt, like, honestly. <laughs> I feel like that hurt a lot. <laughs> hey. Hey, officer. Are you alright? I'm still cuffed back here. Check this shit open. Uh. Bye. Back a couple more times, but we good. All right, now get your ass out. I need to drag myself out that window. I need to drag myself out that window. There you go, Lee. Good shit. I'm about to say that probably hurt a bit. Damn, we fell a distance. It doesn't, I don't think, we, like, it doesn't seem like we fell as far as, like, the, the actual thing was showing, but we fell a good distance. Mr. Officer. The officer's shotgun is on. Let me go ahead and pick that shell up. Oh wait, I ain't got to do it later. Why would he have needed that? <laughs> I wonder why. God damn. You good, officer? Mr. Officer, are you okay, officer? Let me get them keys, homie. Because I don't know if you're alive, so we're going to ha-ha. Damn it, Lee. Why are you dropping shit? You better hurry up and grab them bitches. Back fastly. Grab them. There you go. All right. Officer. Oh shit, go Lee. Shit, go. Go Lee. God damn it, go. Yeah, back your happy ass up. Grab the shotgun. Grab the shotgun, Lee. You already got the bullet, so grab the shotgun. Shit, god damn it. What was the point of me grabbing the damn bullet? Don't make me do this. Yeah, you damn, you damn cop. Fuck, fuck 12. <laughs> Oh my god, is that Clementine? Finish shooting. Oh shit. You better run, Lee. You better get your ass a run. You should have grabbed that shotgun. I get why you didn't. That would have kind of caused a bunch of weight, but you should have grabbed it just in case you get more bullets. 
The police don't know why there was only one, one bullet that entire time. Because I don't think uh, the cops shot that many damn bullets. Oh god, that's a lot. You bad goalie. Should I hurry up? Run, Lee, run. Run, Lee. Run. Go, my boy, go. There you go. Good job. You made it. We escape from the zombies. Hello? Anybody? No ladder. I'm not getting up there anyway. This leg the way it is. To Anybody the treehouse. Please. Hello? Anybody in there? I Clementa. I a little girl in the forest. Help! Are you up there? I'm not one of those things. Alright, I'll stop trying to talk to Clementa. Alright, let's go inside, Lee. Just go in. Good job. In. You can open the door. Okay? Probably. Ah. Hello. I'm not an intruder. Or one of them. We know Lee. We we know you aren't. Well, I know you are. More help than I do. Yeah, they probably do. Oh, it's a unicorn. She didn't even get to fully draw it. What's that? I think I think her her parents are dead as hell. Daddy? Huh? Yeah, I was gonna say get get you some drink. There it is. You need to be quiet. Why? I don't know why I'm trying to act like I ain't never played this game. I've played it. Are you okay? I'm okay. They tried to get me. But I'm hiding until my parents come home. What's your name? I'm Clementine. This is Clem my house. Hi, Clementine. I'm Lee. Where are your parents? They 
took a trip and left me with Sandra. They're in Savannah, I think, where the boats are. Okay. Are you safe? I'm outside in my treehouse. They can't get in. That's smart. See? Can you see <laughs> me? I can see you through the window. Oh shit. Oh god, Clementine, you could've gave me a heads up. You could've gave me a heads up, Clementine. You damn child. No, I'm joking. Let's try to knock himself up. Back your ass up. Get off of me. Get your ass off of me. I don't want you. And your decaying ass. Yeah, you know how to murder people. Ah. <laughs> the way her jaw moves with <laughs> it. Her jaw said, hell. Wow. <laughs> Man. Hi there. Did you kill it? Yes. I don't know. I think so. Sometimes they come back. Mm -hmm. Have you killed one? No, but they get shot a lot. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah, I want my parents to come home now. I don't think they're ever coming I home, girl. That might be a little while, you know? Oh. Look, I don't know what happened, but I'll look after you until then. What should we do now? Uh, look for help before it gets dark. Yeah. We need to find help before it gets dark. Yeah, it's not safe at night. Yeah, if I say it's better to go out there and stay cave. close to me. Because I've I've played this game and done like each uh, version in the past, and yeah, it's a lot better to go out during the day on this. Hold on, Clementine. Damn, I said stay with me, not go away. Uh, uh, oh, man. I ain't never getting home to Mama at this rate. This sucks. You know, it's hot this night. What's the matter? Should I stay? What? I don't want to sleep should in the treehouse tonight. Should I, go? I don't know if I should leave. What if my parents come home? I won't leave you alone. Well, let's go somewhere safe that's close, okay? That's a good idea. Okay. I got you, Clem. I got you. I'll protect you to the end of time. I got you. It's okay. Hey, man! Holy shit! Don't eat us! We're not gonna hurt you. Yeah. Thought for a second you and the little one were both gonna give us the chomp. Do you know what the hell this is? No, I do idea. not. So I mean, I know. You could yeah. say that. I'm Sean. Sean Green. Lee, this is Clementine. I'm Chet. Chet. We shouldn't be out in the open like this. How about you help us clear the way and we'll take you and your daughter out of here and down to my family's farm. It should be safer there. I'm not a dad. I'm... Um, her babysitter. Her we'll go babysitter. with that. Her parents are out of town. Let's get I love how Clementine didn't say it's shit. It doesn't say sense. like, oh, Clementine knows you lie. It's just says Sean thinks what that you're a babysitter do? now. <laughs> I... 
Yeah, monsters coming. We gotta go. Leave quick. Let's go. Y'all two couldn't move this shit by yourself. I got it. Y'all had to get the guy with the hurt leg to do this shit. Oh yeah, Clementine, get in there, Clementine. That's how you do it. Just, just hopping into that. <laughs> As babysitters go, I'd say your parents owe you a tip. <laughs> I could, I could have just said I'm a neighbor, or because you, you, I think if you say you're, you're just a guy, then they try to get Clementine away from you. But then saying like you're the babysitter makes it like the best possible outcome. I'm pretty sure. But Clementine gets badass later on though. Like she's still like she 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 cool now, but she gets badass later on. Like in the in uh, season two in the final season. Sean, I'm gonna run on home. My mama's gonna be in a snit. No sweat, man. I'll catch you tomorrow night. It was nice to meet you both. <laughs> He's got an achievement. <laughs> Just found help, and now you're responsible for a little girl. Thank God you're okay. I was worried it'd be bad here, too. Been quiet as usual the past couple days. Old Brecken down the way thinks his mare's gone lame, but that ain't nothing new. I wouldn't mm -hmm. have made it back without you. What's up, Herschel? Well, I'm glad you took him with you then. You've brought a couple guests. Your boy's a lifesaver. Glad he could be a help to somebody. So it's just you and your daughter then? Oh, not his daughter. He's the babysitter. Honey, do you know this man? Yes. Okay then. <laughs> well, looks like you hurt your leg pretty bad there. Clipping time, clipping time's a real one. Yeah, it's not doing so good. I can help you out. Sean, run on in and check on your sister. You take a seat up on the porch, and I'll go see what I have. Let's have a look. Uh, yeah. Does he know who I am? I forget. Hell. Could be worse. That's what it sounds like. Seems like things got awful bad in the cities. What did you say your name was? It's Lee. Nice to meet you, Lee. I'm Herschel Green. I love Herschel. This happened. He's a lot better. In my opinion, he's a lot better in... Well, trying to get away from one of those things. That's so. What yeah. type of danger has the girl seen? Um. She's, she's safe, safe now. You're serious about taking care of her then? Yeah. What choice is there? House is full up with mine. We got another displaced family of three sleeping in the barn. You and your daughter yeah. are the rest there, and we're done here. I didn't catch your name, darling. Clint. Clementine. Can't imagine what Clementine. you Clementine. Clementine. Um, looking after her until we. Clementine's the homie, man. She lied for me and shit. <laughs> Dad, so I'm thinking, first thing tomorrow, we gotta reinforce the fence around the farm. That doesn't seem necessary. I don't know what you saw on TV or heard on the radio, but there's some serious shit hitting the fan. I don't think anyone knows how big it is yet. Your son's right. You're gonna want to fortify this place. Stuff like that doesn't happen around here, Sean. Dad, I'm serious. Sure, Dude, sure, sure, on. sure. Tell your son you ends up dead. There, man. I saw a cop come back from the dead. Well, do what you think you should. We got plenty of chores as it is. Me and those folks in the barn can help out in the morning. We gotta do it. Really. I already said okay. Well, I'm all done it's here. Attitude. You should start to feel better tomorrow. Thanks. And if your leg gets hot or the swelling doesn't go down, you're probably dealing with an infection. 
What do we do then? We'll probably just have to shoot you. We'll clean it, redress it, and you'll be fine. Okay. <laughs> that <be> Virgil. <laughs> There's um, blankets and such in the barn. We'll be seeing you bright and early. Got bright and early. Which way you think you're headed? Towards making, I suppose. You know it. All right, then. Let's go, Clem. It smells like... Manure. Manure? Like when a horse plops? Just plops. Like that. <laughs> uh. Man, I haven't played this game in forever, so this is bringing back some memories. How far is Savannah? Pretty far. Oh. Oh, shit. I didn't okay. know he was actually going to say that. I mean, we're in Macon, Georgia, and then you're trying to get to Savannah, Georgia. I love you, baby. <laughs> Just fell asleep, bro. Damn. I already have a nightmare. That's crazy. Bro, I had nightmares so damn quick. Hey, get up. Oh, my God. Is that my boy, Kenny? Itchy. Well, you slept in a barn, little lady. Lucky you don't have spiders in your hair. <gasps> but I bet your daddy <laughs> scared them all away, huh? I'm uh, not her dad. Name's Lee. I'm Kenny. Dad, we're in the middle of fence. There's a tractor and everything. <laughs> we better get going, or we won't hear the end of it. That's my boy, Duck. Ken Jr. We call him Duck, though. Yeah, Duck. I said Doug. Dodging or quacking? Quacking. Dad! Uh -huh. See? The word is you were on your way to Macon. My family's from there. Well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. Sure, we'll tag along. We'll tag along. It's a plan, then. Honey, Duck, this is Lee. And uh, what's the girl's name? Clementine. 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 That is a very pretty name. Thanks. Well, we should get to work. We've all seen what those things can do out there, so the faster we get this fence up, the better. I want to mm -hmm. build a fence. Yeah? <laughs> well, I need a good foreman. You can sit on the tractor and yell at me whenever I take a water break. On the tractor? Cool! <laughs> duck and I will hop to it. Fucking duck. Uh. I can keep an eye on your little girl here on the porch. We can visit. Yeah. Thank you, thank you. Hey there, girls. You two actually look relaxed. I think we're doing just fine. Clementine was just telling me about first grade. Oh, uh, how was that? It's easy. Well, yeah. So, you good? Anyway. It's almost like we didn't see people eating each other for the past three days. It's peaceful here, isn't it? Um. How do you do it? How was the how city? How did you handle getting through the city? Kenny just drove. We passed so many people that needed help, and we just passed people over some. Just, just. Uh, it's okay. It's fine. You don't have to say anymore. I want to go home tomorrow, but even then I can't take away the things we... the things Doc went through. Don't you want to go back to the moment before you knew about all of this? Hmm. This could all be Providence, you know? Not what we saw. I was in the back of a police car. When something is happening to you. What you're being given. Maybe this will all work out. Your optimism is refreshing. New. In these past couple days, at least. So, uh, what do you do when corpses aren't walking around? I'm a veterinarian back in Fort Lauderdale. Like Herschel here, except more with dogs and cats and uh, not horses. What is it that you do, Lee? 
I used to teach up at the University of Georgia. We need to hope that we can go back to our jobs soon, Lee. Back to normal. I don't think we're ever going to. can't stay like this. No, I used to. Uh, yeah, my mistake. We'll all be home soon. Back in a bit. Okay, Lee. It's crazy that Clem never finished. Are you having a nice time with Katya Clementine? Yeah. Katya. But, yeah, it, it's crazy that she didn't, or she was in first grade, and then all this happened. It's not the most reliable pickup in the world, but it gets the job done. Hey there. What's up, Kenny? Kenny. So what's your family's plan? Get back on down to Lauderdale and let this mess get sorted out. Government will start handing out shots and the National Guard will do its thing. On the odd chance things got too bad, we could hop on my boat, I guess. You've got a boat. I'm a commercial fisherman, catching mackerel, dolphin, whatever's biting and paying. Oh. Katya wouldn't be wild about it, but the boat's not that bad. Poor dolphins. Need any help? No, I think I got it. Do you need any help? What do you mean? I mean, in taking care of that little girl. You know what you're doing? You got kids of your own? I have no, I have no idea. idea what I'm doing. At least you're honest. Shit. Better than I was when Duck showed up. You'll figure it out. Yep. How's your son doing? Good, I think. Kachi's got a sister up in Memphis. We were coming back from visiting her. We were in a gas station and some guy grabbed my boy. I thought he was kidnapping him. I was on the fucker in about two seconds and... Christ. Just lucky I was there. We saw a lot of bodies before we stumbled upon Herschel's. But mm -hmm. we're a tough family, Lee. Ain't nothing gonna phase us. See ya. Showed interest in this family. Yep. Seems like those two are getting along. Alright guys, that's going to be the end of this first episode. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you